Supply chains in Europe lack connectivity, visibility and collaboration. And Iconet offers solutions to work more effectively with today's supply chain and logistics infrastructure. Iconet is building Communications Hub software that enables collaboration between multiple supply chains, multiple shippers and logistics providers. And in doing so, will reduce overall lead times, errors and costs. Through enabling real-time visibility of goods in transit or storage at any time, Iconet also delivers real-time collaborative planning and rerouting. Today, data capture is highly manual, using barcodes or QR codes and lots of paperwork. By contrast, Iconet utilizes the physical internet. The physical internet is similar to the data internet, but tied to physical objects moving around in the real world. With Iconet, data capture is automated and updated in real time, including information collected from a range of sensors embedded into the infrastructure. The data collected includes location and movement, and can include additional information on causes of potential damage or loss, such as temperature control, jolts and vibration. The data is shared using secure cloud-based platforms. The Iconet platform pools freight and shares assets, allowing trusted collaborative planning and execution of transport and logistics along end-to-end -end supply chains, and in doing so aims to deliver a far more efficient and effective supply chain for all participants. Firstly, capacity. Freight logistics is forecast to grow by 40% in volume by 2040. However, across Europe, the average unused capacity of road freight transport including completely empty running, is over 25%. At the same time, many European cities exceed EU-designated maximum pollution levels. Whilst freight transport represents only 4% of total vehicles on the road, it accounts for 25% of all transport emissions, including empty running. And although the logistics sector often embraces new technology, the communication and reporting structures are often very traditional and lack of data sharing is recognised as a barrier to collaborative working. A new generation of business leaders are looking for digital solutions. So today, supply chains can be very efficiently and effectively organised by professional operators when these supply chains operators planned. Let's take an example. A pharmacy in Hamburg needs to replenish their stock of disposable towels. The manufacturer in Barcelona has product available in stock and ready to ship and contacts the usual carrier with the delivery requirement. The carrier organises the route. A truck collects the pallet with cases for Hamburg and delivers them to a local train depot. The container is loaded onto a train. However, somewhere in France, there is a delay to services and our freight train is shunted into sidings. Neither the carrier, manufacturer or the pharmacist know that this has happened. By Wednesday, the pallet should have arrived at the pharmacy, where stockouts and gaps in shelves has meant that the manager has restocked from their own back-of-shop emergency stock. The pharmacy calls the manufacturer, who tells them that the delivery should be with them soon. The manufacturer sends an email to the carrier to ask what has happened. The carrier talks to the rail freight provider, who tells them that the freight may be delayed in France. The train is two days late in arriving in Hamburg. The container is unloaded and taken to a local transshipment warehouse where the container is unpacked and pallets moved to a temporary storage location at the rail hub. The next day, three days late, the pallet is delivered. The pharmacy sends an email to the manufacturer to let them know she won't be using them anymore. The manufacturer asks their carrier why the delivery was late and the carrier says they will investigate when they receive the paperwork. The carrier pays transport service providers a few weeks later and a few weeks after that, the carrier is paid by the manufacturer, minus penalties for late delivery. The pharmacy won't use the supplier again, and the carrier doesn't know why the pallet was late, and everyone gets paid weeks later, minus the penalties for poor performance. With Iconet, things would have turned out very differently. The order is placed. The manufacturer automatically forwards the order, but this time via the Iconet platform, which also creates a smart contract. The Iconet platform interrogates data on timetables, current movements, capacities and existing bookings from the data made available by many carriers, rail operators, terminals and road transport providers and other cloud-based data platforms. 
An optimized route is delivered to the selected carrier from Iconet with inputs and data from the rail provider, intermediate transshipment centers, other data platforms, and the final delivery provider in Hamburg. The container load leaves the manufacturer for the rail terminal. Based on the real-time data from the pallet and truck, blockchain technology within the Iconet platform automatically begins creation of transaction records for this delivery chain. The container is loaded onto a train and sets off to Hamburg. A delay is reported by sensors up ahead and it's expected that freight trains will be delayed. The Iconet platform recalculates alternative routing on the basis of real-time data and a new route is delivered to the carrier. The Iconet platform updates the delivery and routing plan, payments and pricing from pre-agreed rates and the blockchain ledger is also updated with the new plans. While the train is en route, the manufacturer receives an urgent order from another pharmacy in Hamburg. The new order is immediately confirmed via Iconet. One of the other pallets in the container, which was heading for a warehouse, can instead be delivered to the second pharmacy. Final delivery plans and the blockchain ledger is updated Tuesday. The freight train arrives in Hamburg. The rail hub unloads the container, on schedule, on time. A pallet is delivered to the second pharmacy and a pallet is delivered to the original customer. With both deliveries, digital confirmation of delivery is transmitted to the Iconet platform. The blockchain ledger is updated, the transactions are completed, and the platform settles all payments. The project has established four proof-of-concept trials. Living laboratories that put the Iconet technologies and solutions to the test in real-world logistics environments. The Iconet project will continue to develop and test concepts, technology and business solutions to utilize the physical internet to enhance and revolutionize transport and logistics. Iconet has the potential to transform supply chains across the whole of Europe and beyond. To find out more about the project, please visit the website and contact the team.